Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and today I have another sneak peek from Diamond Art Club to share with you all. Eee! Thank you so much Diamond Art Club for sending this to me. Um, this is actually going to be released tomorrow which is Saturday the 25th of June and it'll be available just like just like always uh, at 9 a.m. Pacific time for Ruby and Diamond Club members, and it'll be 9.30 a.m. This is all Pacific time, excuse me. 9, 9 a.m. Pacific for Ruby and Diamond members, and 9.30 a.m. Pacific for general release. It's a round drill diamond painting. I know a lot of you have wanted round drill diamond paintings. This one is special. I hope you're ready. This one is gray bunny with flappy ears look how cute that is by susan win winget winget win i'm so sorry susan <laughs> so this is a 51 by 66 centimeters painting let's just get into it i'm going to show you what it looks like how are you all doing today happy friday today is very very rainy super duper rainy here in Southwest Ireland so that's why the lighting is a little bit iffy but we're working with it we're working with it today I hope you are all well here we go now aha so this is the contents of the box we have the painting with the drills we have a sticker and we have a toolkit and just like before I'll show you the toolkits but they do vary from kit to kit a little bit all right oh my okay let's see <laughs> it kind of fell apart in there a little bit all right so we've got what have we got here all right first let me just pick this up we have a diamond painting pen we have a grip mine got squished a little bit that's okay we have some wax for the pen we have multi-placer tips these go into the tip of the pen so that you can pick up more than one diamond at a time we have a tray with a stopper so that you can pour your diamonds in here, shake them up, and they get all nice and, and straightened. And then we also have, oh, we have a little cover minder. This can pull back the plastic and hold it back for you. This one's got little hollow flakes in it. That's really cute. And also got, oh, we've got this washi tape that actually technically technically there's two here um there's supposed to only be one but it looks like it got cut in the machine so now we have a mini washi tape and a regular washi tape by accident that's a really pretty washi tape though and we have a pack of baggies which is great uh you can store your excess diamonds in here uh if you're not working from a container system there's plenty of bags in here to fit all of the diamonds or all of the colors one bag per color like movie magic <laughs> the sticker you can put that on the box or in your journal if you like to journal your diamond painting progress but now I'm gonna open this up and show you all the oop <laughs> all the contents of what's inside here so let's go there we go it's gonna be one of those days isn't it we've got instructions right here and a thank you Right here, oh look, this is a bigger picture of our diamond painting. Isn't it adorable? <gasps> I love it. <laughs> I love it. I love watercolor anyway, but this is just so cute. This is a sticker sheet. You can peel these off to put them on your container system. And you can tell how many AB diamonds are in this kit. There are five different colors of AB diamonds, and I'll show you what that looks like in just a minute. But there are 59 colors overall goodness so here are our drills round diamond drills very pretty and pastel colored 
and I'll show you those in just a few minutes as well. But first, let's have a look at the painting itself. So is this the bottom? It's the bottom. So, <gasps> so cute. I'm just gonna roll it backwards a little bit so that you can see it nice and flat. I think this is so cute. Thank you so much for sending this to me. It's adorable. <gasps> Look at it. All right. So this isn't too big. It's actually really good size for my table. Again, this is a 51 by 66 centimeter. And you can see here, there's the rabbit and the pretty flowers. There's a legend on both sides and there's the logo at the top. Do what makes you sparkle. We've got the details about the artist here at the bottom and all kinds of other information that you may need. There is a lifetime warranty on your canvas when you purchase it directly from diamondartclub.com. And actually, let me show you the symbols. Get you nice and close here. So you can see that there's a faint circle around the the symbol itself, a, a faint circle here around the symbols like this. That'll help you place those diamonds. And I'll show you the bunny, bunny's face. It's actually a lot bigger than I expected. Isn't that cute? One word of advice is just to be careful on the lighter areas. You'll want to probably single place especially with the white diamonds like up here. I find personally that I have to single place in the lighter areas or else I will see the little black or gray outline of the circle and that drives me nuts. So I do I do recommend using the single placer for that and then multi-placing for everything else. That's me. That's just how I do it. But that is so adorable. I love the definition of these pink flowers. Those are very pretty. And the one thing about round diamonds on a canvas, this symbol, it's that it's not as clear looking as the square ones are. So you really have to do the painting to see the finished look. But if you do actually get this kit and you complete it, please tag me on Facebook or Instagram. I've just created new accounts. I'm Rachel Ray Official on both Facebook and Instagram. Cute. Are you ready to see the diamonds? If you'd like to skip this part, you can skip ahead and see where those specialty diamonds go. Ooh, they're really shiny and sparkly. I like them a lot. This is 712, 937, 3743, 3756, 471. We have two bags. 3865. There's also two bags. 318. Here's our first AD, 108. So see how that has an extra shine on it that kind of looks iridescent? That's what AB is. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And it just glimmers that little bit extra. 155, 3609, 762, 128. Here's another AB diamond with a straggler. You can see it has a slight pink and yellow and green shimmer to it. 3746, 340, 141. Here's another AB our third AB. This is white AB. And this one also has the pink, yellow, green, purple shimmer. 3023, 3852, and 890. So Four thirteen, thirty-eight sixty-one, one fifty-two. Is that? That is not an AB color. Sorry, there might be four, not five. I I mistake. Stick that for an AB. Five fifty-four, 
There's a short one, 415, 472, and 739. And then we have this one, 3354, 3866, 580, 168, 169, 603, 414, 819, 130. Here's our last 80 diamond, yellow. And this one has lots of pink and green and a little bit of blue as well. Very pretty. 310, 648, 3821, 794, 778, 3839, 791, 225, and 3799. All right, so I was mistaken. There's only four AB diamonds. So let's see where they go here on the canvas. We've got the first color as 108, which is the green, and that is actually highlighting in the darker areas of the leaves. All along in the leaves on the outside, you can see that darker green. That is the AB for the green. Number two is the light pink, 128, and that is in the flowers up here, the little pink flowers, and just a few areas highlighting these pink flowers here and also at the bottom down here. I do not see any pink AB in the ears of the rabbit. Number three is the yellow and that is in the center of the pink flowers. You can see that very bright yellow right here along the side in the middle just like this. And number four is the white AB 141 and I can see that here in the white flower Let's see, right here in this white flower, just here. Where else would I be if I was an AB diamond that's white? There's a whole bag of it. I thought that there would be more, but I don't see any more of the white AB. Just in the white flowers, oh, there's just a little bit there in the pink. Here in these white flowers right here. A little bit here and a little bit up there too. So that is where the specialty drills go on this painting. I really like this one. It's really nice and soft. This looks like it would make a really great print for the, you know, let's say a nursery or uh, even just a children's space or if you're just looking for that kind of whimsical garden aesthetic. If you're the kind of person like me who doesn't hang all of their diamond paintings, you just enjoy doing them, I think this one would be a really good one. Just be warned that this one, I would consider this one to be a little bit more advanced just because it's not what I would consider color blocking. It's not exactly confetti, but it will be a lot of color changes in small areas. You could use a three or four placer uh, on your pen to make this go a little bit faster. And if you need some help deciding how to do that, I do have a video on how to multi-place and I plan on updating that soon as well. So that's it, everybody. Uh, I hope that you'll follow me over on my new Instagram and Facebook pages, Rachel Ray Official. I'll have the links down below. If you are interested in purchasing this kit, like I said, it'll be available tomorrow. And if you're new to purchasing from Diamond Art Club and you've never purchased before, I do have a coupon code for you if you would like to use it, but you're under no obligation to do so. It's totally up to you. But that information is down in the description. And since I'm an affiliate, I do earn a small commission and I thank you in advance if you decide to use my code. What do you think? I would love to know what you think about this picture down below in the comment section. Let me know if you're going to get anything this weekend from Diamond Art Club. And until next time, I hope you take care, stay safe, and I'll see you soon. Bye! <laughs>